I'm Barry Jones, I'm the head of composites here at the team. So the whole process starts with a pattern. So we get a pattern um, that's machined over in our pattern shop and that's the surface that we're looking for to come back to. So from that surface there, on each of these two, we make a mould. And the moulds are all carbon fibre. The reason we make them for carbon fibre is we're able to cure them and keep the same stability on the component um, as the mould is. Basically, this mould surface here is representative of the um, lower surface and this of the upper surface. But what we do then, once we've manufactured these two moulds, these will go into the autoclave to be cured. These will be very supple when they're plied up on this surface here and this basically, once this is cured, you get the solid surface you can work from. Once you've made your mould, in the clean room behind us, the guys basically lay up a specific laminate with a specific cloth and a specific orientation and they'll manufacture that and we've again the different pre pregs different cloths that we use they'll basically ply these into their mold to make the shape um, onto each surface once they've completed that these two molds will come together they'll run some bagging material through the center of them and these will be bagged and ready for cured we've got a sample of a component that's bagged just here what we do with this is basically we take we take all the air out, all the air is extracted out from the mould surface and extracted out of the bag. What that does is that consolidates all of the prepreg to the mould surface, taking away all of the air and then giving us the perfect surface that we've got from the mould. And then from here, these are loaded in to the autoclave and cured. So all the material that's on here at the moment is still green and supple. And once it comes out of the autoclave, then it's cured in this state and it's in usable state.